so we got this thing peeled let's head on over to the shop get it prepped get it on up there and get it installed All right, because those other newel posts were skinned down and fairly, fairly smooth, we want to match those. So I've got some 50 grit sandpaper I put on my big belt sander, and we're going to go ahead and hit a bunch of these rough spots, smooth this on out. But before we get set up and start sanding these, I want to grab these log dogs. It's a perfect opportunity to show you how these are used. You may remember a while back, I showed you a video when we made these. We've got these for sale, you know. We're going to set these flat, one on each side, just to keep this log from rolling. All right, gents, let's get started. making this perfectly smooth. We just want to take out some of these real rough spots. So the next step is to cut it down to length. And I've got my two measurements that we got last week when we were up there. We're going to go ahead and just square up this one end, pull our dimensions from there. Alright, so the first one is 42 and a half and the other one is 46. inside the log. So I'm just going to scribe out where the uh, base plate will be. We'll do the same thing on this one. See we're going to be using a 7 8 drill. So I want to come in about an uh, inch and a quarter. Yep. We're just going to want to make sure we line it up, pull them both ways. this in and maybe hit them a little more with the center and they'll be ready to go. Hey, I appreciate you stopping by to watch this video. And if you haven't done so already, be sure to click subscribe right here. And come on back next week. We'll get these installed. Start working on the hand railing. This has been Mitchell Dillman with LogFurnitureHowTo.com. We'll see you again next time.